it revolutionizes healthcare for women on the East End. I think that when we're facing surgery for a potentially difficult disease or any disease, it's scary. And to be able to say, I have this technology that will make you recover faster, have uh, less blood loss at your surgery, it will help you get out of bed and get back to your life sooner, feeling better. That's a reassuring piece of it, that a technology that allows patients to go home faster and be with their families sooner is wonderful. I was only in bed for one day. Yeah. <laughs> one night. I was up the next day, walking around. Mm -hmm. I'm doing, I'm feeling great. Doing wonderful. God, the, the laparoscopic components, which many of us are familiar with laparoscopic surgery, basically it's surgery done through tiny incisions in the abdominal wall where little ports are placed and then the instruments are long and skinny and you move them around in the patient to do the operation. What the Da Vinci technology does is that it, it puts those laparoscopic arms in the hands of a robot that's going to correct for surgeon tremor, but also create much less movement around the port site where we place those instruments so that the end result is less pain. The robot has all of these, these, these wristed instruments that actually have 360 degree range of motion which is better than the human wrist. And so that we'll attach our fingers with Velcro straps to the robotic arm. And then the, as the instruments open, it's really my fingers opening and closing the instruments and as I move my wrists, the robot wrists stop. I can pause the robot, reposition my wrists, and then allow the robotic wrist to go much further. So what it does is it allows the, the surgeon much more freedom of movement. The thing that the robot does, and you can't see it on our screen, I can only see it at the surgeon console, is that the robot has actually two cameras, not one. And because it has two cameras, each eye gets its, gets its own vision. Instead of turning everything even into an HD image, it's like watching Avatar in 3D versus 2D. That your image is much better, your resolution is much better, and then rather than seeing a flat image on a laparoscopy screen, you have a three-dimensional image that you could see in real life. The only difference is that the 3D image that you see live is much closer to the target anatomy. So whereas if you're operating an arm's length away, you may not see a tiny blood vessel. Here you see every single blood vessel. And the result is much less loss. If I may talk about Denise one more time, if we lost a tablespoon of blood with Denise's surgery, it was a lot. And that was because I could identify every single vessel and cauterize every single vessel. So it's a lot more elegant, it's a lot more refined, it's a lot cleaner, visibility is a lot better. And then the end result is an outstanding patient outcome.